What's up, losers? Episode three of Presidents Play Google Feud. And this time it gets serious. That's right. Biden and Trump are competing against each other this video, and the winner receives $1 million. This is going to be the easiest $1 million I've ever made. This old man is useless. Bring it on, Donnie, you fat pig. I will be the referee this video, and I will pick the Google phrase for both of you to complete. And whoever has the most points at the end will win Trump's $1 million. I hope you are a better referee than you were a President Obama, else this will be a shambles. Zip it, you fat orangutan. I have decided Biden will go first, so Joe, click on the category I have made that says Biden's round to see your Google phrase. I'm so excited for this. I hope you have given me an easy first round Obama-rama. What the actual hell is this Obama? The Google phrase you have, Joe, is Donald Trump. So you have to try and guess what most people on Google are searching after the word Donald Trump. This is messed up, Barack. The top search is clearly going to be Donald Trump is a sex icon. I think we all know that is not going to be the top search, Donnie. Comment below what you think the top search will be this round, guys. And if you get it right, Trump will buy you a Lamborghini. God, I hate everything about you, Joe. What's your first guess going to be then, Biden? Well, seeing as Trump is the world's biggest criminal, I'm guessing a lot of people are Googling when he's going to prison. So Donald Trump prison is my guess. That's fake news, you moldy bag of dust. Name one crime I've ever broken. How about breaking the law for being the world's fattest and biggest bitch, Donnie? Holy crap. Joe is on smoke tonight, and you got 9,000 points for that. I just get competitive when I know I'm competing for money. It gets my blood going. I will get your blood going all over the floor if you don't shut the hell up, Biden. Bring it on, Ronald McDonald. My next guess is terrible president because Donald Trump is a terrible president. There's no way this is going to be right. Ha, ha, ha. Told you, Biden, I'm the greatest president there has ever been. What the hell was that laugh, Donnie? That is what you call a rich man's laugh, Barack. When you have billions of dollars in the bank, that's how you laugh. More like a racist laugh. That is how you laugh when you are the world's fattest and most racist person alive. Anyway, you have 9,000 points, Joe, with three wrong guesses remaining. My next guess is racist because Donald Trump is a racist. That is fake news, Biden. I'm friends with Obama, so it's impossible for me to be a racist. What the fuck is that supposed to mean, Donnie? You know exactly what I mean, Barack. You gave me the end pass the other day, don't you remember? I might use my end pass right now, actually. Donnie, don't you dare. I never gave you the end pass, you idiot. Don't you dare say the N word again. I'm going to say it right now, Obama. And it's going to be all your fault because you are the one that gave me this end pass. No, I didn't, you idiot. This is just proving you are a racist and we will get canceled if you say it, Donnie. Fuck it. I'm going to say it. Here we go. Are you ready, boys? Donnie, Donnie no. no. Joe, just kick him from the call quickly before he says it and put your guess in. Here we go. I'm going to say it. Obama, you are my new... Holy shit, that was close. I kicked him from the call just in time. That was our closest call yet. Good work, Joe. Now you can guess in peace. And my guess is racist. Uh, Donald Trump is a racist. Good job, Biden. I can't believe that was actually so high up. 7,000 points for Trump being a racist. Yay, can we get 4,000 likes on this video for Trump being a racist? Settle down, Joe. Let's get 4,000 likes, but not in honor for Trump being a racist. Fine, then everyone like the video if you're not racist. Biden, you cannot call people racist if they don't like the video. I just did, Obama-rama. I'm not playing any games today. Can we invite Trumpy Rumpy back in the call? I miss his fat orange ass. But he's just going to say the N-word and get us canceled again. He won't. I believe he has learned his lesson. Fine, invite him back, but be ready to kick him if he goes to say anything bad again. Okay, I'm bringing him into the call again now. What's up, bitches? The king is back. Welcome back, Trump. Hey, Obama, what's happening, my new... Oh, my God, I kicked him out just in time again. He's such an idiot. I'm giving him one more chance. I'm going to invite him in again. What the fuck? Why do you guys keep kicking me from the call every time I go to say the N-word? Because you can't say that on YouTube, Trump. In fact, you can't say that anywhere. Why? What's wrong with the word nuclear buddy? Me and you are nuclear buddies, Obama, because we have both had access to the launch codes. My God, how does he get me with that every time? You cannot just keep making up different words for the N-word, Trump. Yes, I can, actually. I can do whatever I want. I am Donald fucking Trump. More like Donald the fat ass. Haha, <laughs> good one, Joe. Biden, you rock rotting corpse of a man. You make my grandfather look young, and he's been dead for 70 years. Well, at least I am not a fat ass like you, Trump. In fact, that's my next guess. I bet loads of people are Googling to see how fat Trump is. Donald Trump is fat. What the actual fuck? <laughs> oh my God, I don't believe it. Donald Trump is a fat ass. Is actually the sixth most Googled thing. Oh my God, Obama, it gets better. I just Googled it, and this is the first picture that comes up. I'm going to Google this every day, so it becomes the number one Googled thing. God damn, look at the size of that ass. You may not like it, boy. Boys, but this is what the peak male athletic form looks like. Athletes don't have a diet that consists eating just McDonald's, you idiot. Hey, Barack, I only eat the healthy stuff from McDonald's, like the Big Macs and the double cheeseburgers, so it's okay.
okay. How many Big Macs do you eat a week, Donnie? Enough to stay in this incredible great athletic state, Joe, you wrinkly old man. At this rate, with how many Big Macs Trump eats, he's going to die before Biden does. Don't worry, Donnie. If you do die before me, I will make sure to put a Big Mac on your tombstone. You are not going to outlive me, you idiot. You're basically dead already. Whatever you say, Grumpy Trumpy. I'm thinking one of these answers are Big Mac related. So my next guess is Donald Trump eats Big Macs. Wrong, Biden, you idiot. You suck at this game. Don't listen to him, Joe. You have 21,000 points with two guesses remaining. That's pretty good. Thanks, Obama-rama. I want this 10,000-point answer, though, to secure the win and the $1 million. I'm actually impressed this useless bag of dust has scored any points, to be honest. He's so old, I don't know how his brain is still working. Trump, you need to stop talking about how old Joe is. He's only three years older than you, and with all the McDonald's you eat, your insides are probably 10 years older than Joe. That's right, grumpy Trumpy, you old bitch. I bet people are Googling Trump's age. That's my next guess. Donald Trump age. Damn good job, Biden. That's the third most Googled answer. This can't be right. Biden is cheating and hacking into Google, changing the answers. There is no way he is scoring this many points without cheating. <laughs> What's wrong, Trumpy, with that fat dumpy? Scared I'm going to win that $1 million off you? The only thing that scares me about you, Biden, is I don't understand how you are not dead yet. Settle down, boys. I feel like $1 million is not a big enough reward for the winner here. I mean, Trump is a multi-billionaire at this point. Yes, I am rich and famous, unlike you two peasants, and I get all the women. Don't forget that part, Obama. I liked it when Trump had to shave his head on episode seven of Wordle. He looked like a shaven testicle. Yes, me too. Comment below for ideas for punishments and future videos for the loser. Can you two freaks shut the hell up? Biden, hurry up and take your turn. The subscribers are getting bored of your old ass. Damn, calm down there, Donnie. I think he has PTSD from shaving his head. I don't have PTSD, you idiots. I'm just getting bored of you two and I want to know what the 10,000 point answer is. Uh, I bet it's Donald Trump is good looking and rich. I can almost guarantee it is not that. It has to be something to do with him being president. Maybe people are guessing Donald Trump versus me to see who will win the next presidential election. That's actually a pretty good idea, Joe. I bet that is up there as well. Jesus Christ, he's actually using his brain. Who would have thought it? Shut up, Trumpy Dumpy. That's my guess then. Donald Trump versus Joe Biden. Come on, please be up there. Damn it, stop scoring points, old man. Nice, Biden. Another 3,000 points there. You're on 32,000 now. Thanks, Obama-rama. I am on a roll right now, and I know what my next guess is, and I'm sure it's going to be the 10,000-point answer. Let's hear it, then, Biden. Keeping the same theme as the last guess, I think it might just be the word president. It looks like the perfect length for that word and feel like people would be Googling that. Your voice makes me want to claw my eyeballs out, Biden. The 10,000-point word is clearly something to do with money, as I am the the richest and most handsome man on the planet. You might actually be the most delusional person I have ever met. Trump. I'm locking in my guess. Donald Trump president, come on, please be the 10,000 points. Damn it. <laughs> Wrong, you bag of rotting dust. Unlucky Joe, you have one guess remaining. I was sure that was going to be right. I need to get the 10,000 point answer. I need this $1 million. What are you going to do with the $1 million if you win, Joe? Oh, Obama-rama, I have so many good ideas what to spend the $1 million Everyone on. Everyone knows what you're going to use the $1 million to buy you more on. Yeah, I have a a pretty good idea of what you would use it on as well, Joe. What do you guys think I will spend the $1 million on then? Obviously something stupid like a million dollars of ice cream or something like that. Yeah, everyone knows you're going to say something like unlimited ice cream or install an ice cream button in the Oval Office or something like that, Biden. Actually, you are both wrong. I would invest my money very wisely. First of all, I would buy a massive warehouse. Wow, I'm actually impressed, Joe. What would you fill the warehouse with? I would fill it with two items. One half of the warehouse would be mint chocolate chip ice cream and the other half just double chocolate chocolate chip ice cream so I can have ice cream whenever I want. Oh my God, this man is a moron. Joe, you idiot. So we wasn't wrong about spending it on ice cream. Yeah, you were. I said I would buy a warehouse. I don't believe it. He's somehow getting dumber. Joe, please move on and take your guess before you say more stupid shit. Okay, time to score some big points. I need to think of some physical features that stand out on Trump that people would be Googling. Good. Now you're using your brain bite. I've already scored 5,000 points for him being a fat ass. He also has the worst hair I have ever seen. So maybe people People are Googling his terrible hair. That is actually true. What even is that on top of your head, Trump? It looks like a greasy, wet, bleached mop that someone has thrown on top of your head. Screw both of you assholes. I have the greatest hair on the planet. I shampoo and condition my hair three times a day to keep it this blonde and shiny. That mop on top of your head is not blonde and shiny, Trump. It's gray and greasy. But hair is my guess. Donald Trump hair. 
Yes, another 4,000 points. What the actual fuck? Why are people Googling and buying a wig of my hair? Because your hair is so bad. People are probably buying a wig of your hair as a Halloween outfit, Trump. Ha ha ha, get wrecked, Trumpy Rumpy. I don't know why you're laughing, you old freak. People will be buying a life-size cut out of you soon to put outside their houses on Halloween instead of skeletons. Shut up, Trumpy Rumpy. I have got an idea and a question to ask. Oh, God, this could be anything. I always get scared when you have an idea, Joe. Now, this is serious and about this Google feud game. Trump, have you been in any movies before? Yes, of course I have. I am the great Donald Trump. I have done everything in life. Apart from not being a fat ass. Aha, good one, Obama-rama. Screw both of you. I did the TV show The Apprentice, of course, which is known to be the greatest show of all time and been in many movies like the greatest film of all time, Home Alone 2. You cannot just say something is the greatest thing of all time because you were involved in it, Trump. Also, you were only in Home Alone 2 for about eight seconds. Yes, but that was the greatest eight seconds of any movie ever. God, you're an idiot. Well, movies is my guess then. I I bet loads of people have seen The Apprentice and wondered if Trump has been in any movies. Donald Trump movies, come on. Please be up there. Yes, another 6,000 points. Nice work, Biden. You were on 42,000 points. That is a great score. He's fucking cheating. I know he is. I'm not cheating, you fat orange oompa loompa. I am just better than you at Google Feud. You are not better than me, you old freak. I'm still going to beat you when it's my turn. You still haven't got the 10,000 point answer. Trump is right, Biden. You have a great score at the moment. But if you don't get the 10,000 point answer with your last guess, Trump still has a chance at winning. OK, fine. I just need this 10,000 points on my last guess here to guarantee the win. Have you got any? Any idea, Obama Rama? I cannot give you any hints, Joe, or else that would be cheating and give you an unfair advantage. The top answer is clearly Donald Trump has loads of money and is good looking. Okay, it's clearly not that, you idiot, but I would not be surprised if it is something to do with money, as that is all he talks about. The blue box looks too big to fit the word money in, though Obama Rama, I don't know what to put. Just hurry up and take a guess already, you moron. You have taken ages on this. Yeah, I cannot lie, Joe. You need to hurry up already. Michelle keeps yelling at me to come off. She says I spent way too much time with the boys lately. Tell Michelle to join us, Obama. It won't be Michelle's first time with three guys, if you know what I mean. Trump, you watch your mouth. Stop talking shit about my wife before I bitch slap you. Chill, Barack. It was just a prank, bro. Guys, I think I have worked out what the top Google phrase is. Come on, then, Biden, let's hear it. Well, every time I have insulted Trump, I have gained points, such as calling him a fat ass and racist. That's fake news, Biden. I'm neither of those things. Well, you must be a little bit Trump, as they are so high up on the Google search. Also, him being in prison is the second highest result, so it must be something negative. Trump is also one of the dumbest human beings on the planet. So I think I have worked out the phrase. That's rich coming from the man that said he's going to spend his $1 million on a warehouse of ice cream. It's going to melt before you can eat it, you fucking moron. Hold on, Donnie. Let him cook. Looking at the state of his wrinkled, shriveled body, it looks like he has already been cooked. Wait, I didn't even think about my ice cream melting. Damn, I might have to win another million dollars to buy freezers to put in the warehouse. Oh, my God. I can't take this much longer. I'm going to kill it. Biden, please shut up about your ice cream and put your guess already. Fine, because Trump is so stupid, I think the phrase is, he is an idiot. The size of the blue box is the perfect length. Well, here we go. Donald Trump is an idiot. Come on, please be right. No, I don't believe it. Ha ha, you suck, Biden. Don't be sad, Joe. 42,000 is a great score. Donald Trump net worth was the top answer. I knew it was going to be about money. 42,000, I can beat that easily. Move over, Biden. It's now my turn to destroy your pathetic score and claim that $1 million. Hold on just a second, Trump. Because Joe took so long on his turn, I now have to go cook dinner for Michelle. Great. Obama is off to get pegged by Michelle because Sleepy Joe took so long. We will have to do my turn on the next video then. Stop telling people I get pegged by Michelle, you idiot. You're only mad because it's true. Everyone subscribe to Parody Gang and click to watch another amazing video on screen right now.